Annika from the Noble Kuala Lumpur. In this video, I'm going to show you my favorite fine dining restaurants in Kuala Lumpur. The first restaurant I'm going to show you is the Nobu. It is located in the Four Seasons place, just in the city center, so you're almost right next to the Petronas Twin Towers. When you enter the building, you have to go up to the fourth floor, so you always have an amazing view on the city of Kuala Lumpur. In the back they have this little room that I'm just showing you right now with the boat decor and it seems like this room can even be closed. The menu offers Japanese cuisine with Peruvian ingredients. And the name Nobu comes from Nobu Matsuhisa, the globally renowned chef. So let's have a look at the drinks menu. They offer a variety of sake as well as cocktails and wines. Cocktail prices vary between 45 to 85 ringgit, while a glass of wine is between 50 to 75 ringgit. Now on to the food menu. As mentioned, all dishes combine Japanese and Peruvian flavors. They offer a variety of cold dishes, hot dishes, sushi and sashimi, and also tacos and soup. They offer two types of multi-course tasting menu, the signature tasting menu for 450 plus and the Kuala Lumpur menu for 650 plus. So now let me show you what we ordered. We started with some cocktails and the crispy rice and tuna tartar. The crispy rice was cubes of rice that were fried and this combination was extremely delicious. Next we ordered a salmon skin salad which was packed with fried salmon skin and grilled salmon. We also got the sweet potato tempura and Wagyu beef gyoza, which were my absolute favorite. We then ordered the salmon spicy miso tacos. The tacos had a lot of flavor, they were really good, but you can see now how tiny they are. We also ordered the spicy tuna rolls and one chew toro soup, which was my husband's favorite. And finally, we had the California rolls. Of course, I had to have dessert, so I ordered the pinky pavlova. It was a meringue shell filled with raspberry yuzu sorbet and white cream. It was the perfect dessert, which combined lots of flavors as the shell was sweet, but the yuzu raspberry sobe added a little sour taste. With my dessert, I also enjoyed a glass of white wine. The total bill was 828 ringgit, which is around 180 US dollar or 165 euros. So this is what the dining area right at the entrance looks like. We went there during Christmas time, so you can see some Christmas decorations. So now let's check out my favorite fine dining restaurant in KL which is Cielo, located in Bukit Jailon. You can find it in the Vida building. The restaurant and rooftop bar is on the 23rd floor, so you have the most amazing view of the city. A 
Look how beautiful the skyline of Kael is at night. I feel like Cielo is such a hidden gem because the view is just incredible, the food is amazing and look at how beautiful they arranged the place. They have two floors, downstairs is the bar and upstairs is the restaurant area. You even have a Patronas Twin Towers view. And now just let me walk you through the bar because you can also just come for a drink if you like. I just love these lights, they always change colors. I've seen them white, yellow, red, blue, green, purple. Now outside there is also a little pool and there is this very chilled seating area. And now you can see, up there is where we are having our dinner. Upstairs it looks amazing as well. They have a roof that is actually opened, so you are able to enjoy the view at the stars. They offer three set menus, or you can order a la carte. We decided to order a la carte, so for starter I had the salmon tiradito and my husband enjoyed the pulpo. After the starter, they brought us some raspberry sorbet to clear our taste buds. Then for our main course, I had the Mibrasa grilled sea bass with saffron risotto and my husband had the wild caught sea king prawns also with saffron risotto. Both the fish and the prawns were excellent and the saffron risotto was super creamy. I really enjoyed the dish. With both dishes, we also got a side of asparagus with microgreens and a very delicious sauce. Of course, I had to have dessert, so I ordered the creme brulee. It was a cherry creme brulee with rhubarb marmalade. It was very delicious, but the texture was more of a cake than a cream. I also had some wine and my husband an espresso. Our total bill was around 622 ringgit, so that would be around 134 US dollars or 122 euro. Thank you very much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video.